So last question, if you had to change something in Orlando, maybe it's something we're missing. Um, actually, it's something that I've, I have great hope for, which is... Have you ever thought about relocating to Orlando, but you're kind of like, I don't know if I'll really like it. Well, today we're actually having a party with a bunch of our past clients, asking them what they like about living in Orlando, where they came from, and maybe why they don't like living in Orlando. Stay tuned. Three, two, one, go! All right, so who do we have here? Uh, my name is Sean. Sean? And Caroline. And Caroline. So where'd you come from originally? Uh, originally from Utah. Utah, okay. I'm originally from the UK. I could tell. So yeah, if you couldn't. <laughs> and so what, what brought you to Orlando? Your YouTube channel actually <laughs> watching it. you. <laughs> That's amazing. Reasons. And yeah, weather, we like to be outside, okay. so. Awesome, and so if you could change anything about Orlando, right? You've been in the UK, you've been in Utah. I'm sure you probably compare them from time to time. What would you change? The summer humidity, yeah. when you first get here, is a little brutal, although now we've gotten used to it. We just spend our time in the pool and stuff. Sure. Like, we've kind of learned that, but the winter, like, sold it for us here. Yeah. Like, it's, like, drier than we thought it would be in the Orlando area, and, like, we're out with our kids all the time, just something we couldn't get ever in Utah or, like, it's colder back in the places we lived before, so yeah. we love that. <laughs> uh, amazing. What do you wish that Orlando had? Um, probably, probably less bugs. Less you bugs? Know, like, yeah. Yeah. We weren't so used to like how much driving there is here. Like, uh, it's 30 minutes to get to everything, and everyone seems to be used to that. And everything was very convenient from where we were from. Sure. So we're kind of getting used to that. And we're down in Horizon West, so we're still kind of waiting for everything to like be it's built up. But it's so exciting to see everything that like kind of is going in there. We're like, oh, cool! <laughs> like, <laughs> we got a little breakdown. So thank you guys. I appreciate it so much. Appreciate you. <laughs> All right, so who are we with today? Keith Christensen. Rhino Christensen. And so where'd you guys originally come from? New Jersey. What, uh, what brought you to Orlando? Oh, every year traveling here with the kids, going to Walt Disney World, fell, uh, fell in love with Celebration, found you online, yes. wa been watching you for years on YouTube, yeah. and uh, you were one of the main reasons we came here. Um, got it hooked up with Riley yep. and um, landed in Island Village. Should I do it? Shouldn't I do it? What would your be your, your advice? 100% do it. Uh, don't miss New Jersey at all. Was tired of that. <laughs> was tired of those cold winters. Yeah. Wouldn't change anything. Super happy here. Amazing. Same, same answer? Same here. Uh, yeah, awesome. I love it here. What would be like one thing you'd say we could do different? Um, traffic and prices. Prices of what? Everything. Everything. Yeah. I mean, living in the traffic lights. Traffic lights are okay. too long. A little longer. Um, but really, really, Orlando is awesome. Yeah. awesome. But live, living in and around, you know, Disney, things are a little bit expensive, but sure. it's worth yeah. every minute. <laughs> it's worth every minute of it. Annual pass holders go there all the time. Live a few minutes from there. So it's good. great. We love it. All right. Ready. All right. So who do we got with us today? Uh, John. I'm Kylie. Nice to meet you guys. And so where are you from originally? Originally Northern Kentucky. I'm from LA originally, but we've been in New York for about 20 years. Oh, amazing. Okay, cool. So what brought you to Orlando? Uh, I got a job at uh, University of Central Florida. So what's one thing that maybe you guys both like about living in Orlando? You know, being out of the rat race where you still have accessibility to like, you know, the city life but you still have the pleasure of the space and leisure activities of the, the suburbs yeah. and the pool. Sunshine. 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 So LA obviously is super sunny though too. That's true. So people, we got a lot of people coming from California and like the Northeast, everywhere coming down to Florida right now. It's yeah. the fastest growing state. What do you think the difference is, though, maybe between those two states that you came from or those two areas you came from? Probably the taxes. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a big one. So last question, if you had to change something in Orlando, maybe something we're missing in and out. Yeah, it could be anything that maybe we're missing. What would you say? Actually, it's something that I've, I have great hope for, which is, you know, New York, I love like all the like restaurant choices and that kind of thing. But what's fun is, is that we're discovering all these little new restaurants popping up so we're like ooh, that gives me uh great hope yeah. for you know that kind of 
you know, New York culinary experience. <laughs> it's not that it's not Applebee's left and right. It's no. like new stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it's like that, like sense of community, like right here in this area. Yeah. It's so cute. And it's like a little village and it's great. And there's little pockets like Winter Garden and things like that. Where we're currently at, we don't really have that sense of community. Sure. So that's something that we really would like to to build in yeah. our, our new home here. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Okay, All right. So who do we got today? We got Jeremy and Kate. And Rachel and Charlotte. So where are you from originally? We're from Louisville, Kentucky. So what made you move to Orlando? Uh, job primarily, but the weather was a nice plus. Yeah, for yeah. sure. So what's something maybe that, that you love about living in Orlando? Well, the weather primarily. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but no, there's so much to do here. And uh, for our mental health, being able to be outside all the time is awesome. So Days like this in uh, April or not? Yeah, definitely. They definitely help. Of course, the summer is a little more humid, yeah. but you're still at the pool every day. It's amazing. Makes sense. Yeah. What's something that maybe you would change about Orlando if you had to say, like, we're missing this one thing or you just wish it was a little different? We don't love the, all the highway driving. Yeah. I think where we came from, you could get where you need to go without getting on a highway. So you have to get three different interchanges to get from our house to the airport, which is a little annoying, and we like to travel. So, What do you think about raising a family in Orlando? Oh, it's perfect. perfect. I mean, it's so easy. You can get an annual pass to any of the theme parks, and there's all sorts of wonderful family stuff that you can do for free. And like I said, being outside all the time with your family, it's, it's hard to beat. Every day. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's huge. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Yep, appreciate Thank it. You. Perfect. All right, so who do we have today? Laura. Mike. And so where are you guys originally from? LA. Yep, California. California. And so how long, how long has it been that you've actually been in Orlando? We just celebrated over a year, actually. So what originally brought you from LA to Orlando? Relocation to Disney. And so if you had to make any kind of changes to Orlando, you've been here for a year. LA is obviously very multicultural. You've got different restaurants. You've got a lot of cool things in LA, but Orlando's pretty cool. What would you change about Orlando? Oh, I would add a bit way more food diversity. Yeah. Like put a little bit more salt, pepper, or some taste to it. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's, I wish I had a little bit more. And more Trader Joe's, please. Yes. Not just two that I know of. Would you do it again? Would you move again? I would do it. Yeah, I mean, we've really went through this year and and we've become so comfortable with just the culture and the, and the greenery. You just can't help but relax, and it draws you outside. So yeah. we love being out here. Thank you guys so much. Yeah. Good no to see problem. You. Okay. All right, so who do we have today? Steph. Jacques. All right, so you guys are not originally from Orlando. No, nope, we're from Ontario, Canada. Okay. Originally Johannesburg, South Africa. <laughs> <laughs> so it's been a long journey to get to Orlando. It's been it a has. very long journey, okay. yeah. Yep. Why did Orlando end up becoming where you ended up living? We love the beach, so close proximity to that. We're parks people, so huge Disney fanatics, so we couldn't help ourselves really. This is very close to the South African climate that we're used to. So far, has it met up to your expectations? Oh, absolutely. Probably exceeded the expectations for sure, yeah. If people are thinking about moving, what would be your advice to them? Do your research, find out where you want to go. There's so many amazing areas. Reach out to Ken yeah. and his group. They have amazing agents, yeah. Amazing. For sure. I was going to say, watch Ken's videos. Ken, you probably won't believe the story if I tell it to you, but my mom, she does research about all things. And when we told her we're moving to Orlando, she's on YouTube. So she's still in Johannesburg, South Africa. She found you. She texts us back. She says, hey, guys, there's this bloke, Ken. He does really good videos. Have you seen them? We're like, yeah, mom, we've been following for almost two and a half years now. but." So you've made it in Africa, Ken. I'm so excited. We're going international. Let's just bank it, yeah. Absolutely. Thank you guys so much. Appreciate awesome. it. Thank, Thank, you. You. Thank you. All right, so we had over 500 people at our Easter event this past week. I hope you guys learned from some people that moved here that may be something like you. Thinking about moving here, maybe you already live here and you're just looking to move within Orlando. Either way, my team and I would love to be your real estate resource of choice. Hit the subscribe button as we're putting out videos every single week and then reach out, info at positgroup.com. We'll see you guys on the next video.